Hello, my Tauruses, and welcome to Divine Destiny with Debbie. And of course, I am Debbie. Now, I am reading for September 22nd through the 28th. I've done an overview. Things are about to pop. I would, I really would love it and appreciate it if you would watch it. But remember, these are general readings. May or may not resonate. Take what you like. Leave the rest, okay? So we had something with Mercury. Um, it's going to be trining i think with uranus in taurus and there's going to be some news i feel like you're going to hear some news that's going to kind of rock your boat a little bit okay kind of make a shift in things i don't feel like it's a negative one i feel like it's going to rock you and it's like whoa this is something totally different and i think it could be a good it could be good information that comes your way okay so something here in news you're going to hear some you're going to hear some news. Um, unexpected, unexpected news, unexpected news that actually you're going to be okay with after you get over the initial shock. Okay, here we go. Higher power, Holy Spirit. What else do you want to say to your Tauruses? What do you want to say to your Tauruses? Yeah, I keep getting the initial shock. Woo, shock wave, shock wave. One, two, and three. Three cards are face down. Let's see. This one's reverse, so it has a little more oomph to it. Let's see what we've got. Four of Raphael. You are so ready. You are so ready for your changes. You are so ready for this news. You are so ready. It might, Like I said, it kind of pulls the... It's not quite a tower moment, unless we have tower moments, but it kind of you know jars you a little bit, but you are very, very ready. So four is stability, organization, leadership. Raphael is your water energy. Cancer, Scorpio, and Pisces. Scorpio and Pisces are the ones, you know, we, we talk about a little bit more right now. Um, there is this, you know, water energy is what? Spiritual, flowing, emotional, very caring energy at the same time. This is, you know, this is where you're kind of like a fallow moment. This is where you're in between. You're not necessarily uh, satisfied with what you have. You're just not, you know, you don't see what you don't see the opportunities and you don't see what else is out there. You're just kind of stagnant at this time. You're in between. Sometimes this is considered what I consider the fallow, your fallow time where you're resting and getting ready. Again, you're just not ready or I'm sorry, you're just resting right now. You're kind of bored with your situation. You're kind of stagnant with your situation. You're just waiting, 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 waiting. Seek out other possibilities. Look for the magic in life. Be aware of your own emotions. So here she is with her her um, three shells just kind of like there. And, and here somebody comes with another shell, a magical shell. Next card, reverse, not reverse, sorry. The four of Gabriel. Oh, I love the I love the four of fire. Again, we have the four stability. Gabriel is fire energy. It is Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, passionate, burning, determined. What I love about the four of fire, the four of wands, it's a completion. It it completes with a celebration. So there, whatever this is that you've been waiting for, you, it finishes. It finishes, and you celebrate. I like to say, you go to school, you graduate, you celebrate. You are going for interviews, you get the job, you celebrate. You've been engaged, you get married, you celebrate. So there is, this is like now, celebrate your completion. Things are finishing and now it's time for you to celebrate. Time and, and also too, maybe there's a scholarship, something with a scholarship popped in my mind. Time for a celebration. Abundant rewards for hard work. Release yourself from burdensome situations. Let things go and move on. Next card reversed. New beginnings. This is also considered the judgment card. So we have four, four, two, zero, two choices, decisions, zero, God source energy, Archangel Jeremiah. There's a lot of judgment here. There's, I, there's I, well, there's a lot of, not judgment of being judged, when, when we see this card, it's you looking at how far you've come. It's you looking at what you've done right, what you've done wrong. It's you, you know, just kind of looking at your past and saying, this is where I'm at. This is what I am. I'm okay with where I'm going or I'm okay with where I'm at. There's a lot of, there's a big sense of, a sense of, um, I want to say completion. Well, so I'll say it. there's a sense of completion. 
but there's also a sense of just satisfaction and knowing you did the you did the best you could and now you're ready to start again so there is again hearing news surprising news starting a new life finding your purpose a forgiving and compassionate review of the past there's a sense you know this is a sense of like okay i know that i have been I, a sense of purpose um i know yes and it says finding your sense of pur finding your purpose it's like everything that I have gone through is bringing me to this moment. Okay. Let's see what else we might have for you, my Tauruses. Oh, there's, you, you know, like I said, once you get over the shock, whew, it's like, okay, okay. All right. That, okay. We have a couple of cards, one or two cards that popped. I don't know. Let's see. Oh, we have two cards. Th they both fell out, but we're going to Ace of Abundance is a one new beginning of earth energy. Did we talk about earth energy? Your energy. Um, Capricorn and Virgo, money, job, career. So the ace of abundance, this cherub brings wonderful news. And I said, you're going to hear news. A windfall of, uh, okay, a windfall of resources comes your way to help you with your plans. These resources may involve money, advice, or assistance in getting things done. It's a good time to start a new venture change careers or go into business for yourself there may be important contracts to sign if there are get a lawyer okay now let's see what we've got here reversed the eight of emotions water energy and we have eight unlimited opportunities and this kind of, okay you feel a deep longing for something meaningful in your life like i said finding your purpose it's like okay in your heart, you know that there is more out there waiting for you in the world. It may be time to switch careers, move to a new home or city, or initiate other important changes. Do what's right for you and seek out your magical new life. I mean, it, that all, both of the, they all kind of, they all work together. I, you know, you have to see that. They all work together. All right, let's see what else we might have. I'm going to shuffle. There we go. Let's see, what else for Taurus? Lord, source, what else for Taurus? What else for your Tauruses? Taurus, Taurus, Taurus. Magical Taurus, reversed. Fairy of the Mystic Forest. All right, let's see what we got here. You have the power and aptitude to make your dreams come true. All you need now is commitment to make it happen. Ooh. That's an interesting little aside, isn't it? Okay, let's see what else. What crystal or energy would be great for Tauruses? What crystal or energy is great for Tauruses? Hearing, yeah, hearing news, news, news of a wonderful, I don't know, news, news that'll kind of shake you up. Jet, okay, absorbs, if can we get you in, there we go, absorbs negativity, grounding, financial balance, healing, grief, jet. All right, last card will be Archangel Michael, Sword of Light Oracle. I have to remember these. <laughs> Here we go, higher power. What last word, or Michael, Archangel Michael, what last word for your Tauruses, for your Tauruses out there. Somebody's out there that needs to hear this. What do they need to hear? What do they need to hear? Reversed. Ah, oh, one, all is in perfect timing. This is it. It's time to take action now. I'll be here to help you every step of the way. Wow, this is it. Oh, that kind of gives me a little, that kind of gives me a little goosebumps or something. Okay, my Tauruses, interesting times. Do me a favor, please go down here, like, share, subscribe, click on the, on the bell for notifications, manifest, manifest. I'm putting these out on Monday. We've got a full moon on Tuesday. Put it out there. Use this energy. Okay, as always though, my Tauruses, always know that you are loved. Stay shining.
and be blessed. Bye-bye.